You know what I really like about the look of this new Pathfinder concept is that it's a three-row SUV, but it, it hides its bulk well. It's sort of athletic looking, curvilinear but not feminine. It's got a good stance without being overtly macho. As my 13-year-old would put it, it looks kind of swole. What's great about the 2013 Nissan Pathfinder concept is it really keeps the DNA of the previous version. That means it still has 4x4 four four, uh, four-wheel drive capability, towing capability, and seating for seven. But what's different, and why we're calling this the next-gen SUV, is that there's a great balance of SUV capability and interior premium, interior uh, versatility, and friendly advanced technology. When you get inside the vehicle, you'll notice a lot more upscale premium features in the previous version. Things like heated and cooled front seats, heated second row seats, navigation system, and an innovation from Nissan is an all-around view monitor so that when you're backing up, you'll be able to see all around the vehicle, uh, a little bit of a safer way to, to back up. What's exciting about the Nissan Pathfinder concept is we have an innovation in the second row. Consumers can enter easily into the third row without taking a child seat out of the second row. What's great about that is you don't have to take the child seat out and risk the fact that you're not putting it back properly. I think parents will be very, very uh, excited about that. For Nissan, in keeping in the spirit of innovation, this Nissan Pathfinder concept, we're really excited about the fact that we're gonna gain over 25% more fuel economy with this version. Well, thanks in part to the Nissan Pathfinder, I've managed to escape the Chicago Auto Show with my brain largely intact. So we want to thank the nice people at Nissan for inviting us here. We want to know what you think of their cool new car. Go to dadlabs.com and share your thoughts with us. Until then, that's all for us here in the lab.